I actually moved from Georgia, I moved to Boston, but there is no death penalty. And I think that you cannot play God, um, you know, with people uh, who are incarcerated. If there's even an iota of a doubt, and you know, eyewitness testimony is the worst way of convicting somebody because every time, you know, people's testimony changes. You and I can see the same accident and we'll have totally different versions. Welcome back to Nishkam TV, and today we're interviewing Gavitha. So, Kavitha, tell us, tell us a little bit about what you do. Uh, I'm a journalist and I've been a freelance journalist uh, for many years now. And I write about uh, mostly socially relevant topics which are, you know, of... Um, it's very important to do that in today's world of uh, divisiveness. And I also own a multimedia website. It's like a one-stop uh, shop for, you know, uh, global work and social causes. So what you do is great because there's a lot of underrepresentation in minorities and having someone like you who's a journalist to spread our, like, our beliefs and like, who we really are, that's, that's, a, that's a great thing. So tell us, what did you think about the film festival today? So the, the one reason why I really supported the film festival was because it's a women-run initiative and you know that even in today's world, uh, the glass ceiling is there for women, they don't get paid the same amount as men. We still don't have a woman president in the United States, although we've had one in India and some of the so-called underdeveloped nations. Uh, so this is the second year of the film festival and uh, because it's a woman-run initiative, with some very good men supporting them, um, I wanted to support it. I loved um, all the films. Most of them had a social message. And I also saw the film uh, that, that you guys made. And I loved the message behind it. It was very secular. And I always tell people that Sikh Sikhism is not a re religion. It's a way of life. It's a philosophy. And so I think the message was conveyed in a very wonderful way of how we can, uh, we are underneath our skin. Uh, we have the same issues. Uh, we have the same concerns. And I think in today's world, which is a global world, it's very important to live together as a community and help each other rise. And I think your me the message of your film was very, very uh, true to that. Yeah, again, touching on a topic of representation of minorities. So a, a lot of the movies here like show like things going on in uh, third world countries and other places, or and even things going on in America. And some of the movies here really showed that. So, is there any social media or your website or anything you'd like to promote? So, I run a multimedia website and I would love for all of you to contribute to it because I think I have so much hopes from the younger generation because you are the people who are, who are going to change the world, right? And I think all of you are socially already very conscious. So, the name of my website is kavithachibber.com. It's K A V I T A. C double H I double B E R dot com. And do you have a Facebook or Instagram? I do have a Facebook and an Instagram account, and it goes under my name of Kavita Chuba. Okay. Thank you very much for this interview today.